on fucking real. You won't believe who came over. Mike Nelson. I wish I would have videotaped the whole goddamn fucking thing. But Mike Nelson comes over. Right? Soon as he got a whiff that I got beer. First fucking thing he said, I, I says I I said I got beer in the refrigerator and I haven't drank for nine weeks. You know? Because my health is more important. He goes, do you mind if I go drink them? Fucking Mooney the goddamn moocher. I said, I just made a video about that. So if you're not going to drink them, I'll drink them. The fucker's brain dead. The fucker's brain dead. He's got high blood pressure, just like me. And uh, all he cares about is drinking up my fucking beer. And I just told him, as I just made a video about that. Do you mind if I make myself a sandwich? Yeah. I'll eat all your fucking food. I'll drink all your fucking beer. Yeah. And then I'll just fucking leave. Go fuck yourself. So anyhow, anywho. So Mike Nelson's hearing that. And I'm, I'm, I'm making his videos or whatever. Or playing his videos on my TV. And get this. As soon as he got a whiff. That I got fucking money. As soon as he got a whiff. I'm telling you, he's smart. You know, he he you know he 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 knows how to get his way. He's smart. As soon as he got a whiff that I'm gonna go to Festival Foods and go buy a bunch of food in that, he goes, "Duh, do you mind if I go with?" You know, and I'm smarter than him because I'm thinking right away. Sure, he's going to want to come with, right? And uh, are you going to cook me up some of them steaks? Duh, I just don't want one. I want fucking three of them motherfuckers. You know, I have enough money to get five. But he's going to want to eat three. All he cares about is himself. This food that I'm going to buy... It's got to last me until I get more goddamn fucking money. He don't fucking care. He don't fucking understand. So anyhow, anywho, just as he's walking out the fucking door, he goes, well, duh, when are you going to go to festival? He's still on that, you know? And I told him, no, I, 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 you know, I'm not planning it out. I'm just going to go when I go and that's it. You know? So, no. I, I turned him down. He popped a big ass fucking attitude telling me to go fuck myself and, and uh, sure, fine, that's how it goes. This motherfucker got his goddamn fucking paycheck, right? He got his goddamn fucking paycheck, blew it in a goddamn fucking bar, and now he wants to help fucking eat up my fucking little bit of paycheck I got left after paying my rent. I ain't getting no more goddamn money. I ain't fucking working. He don't understand that. All he's thinking about, yeah, this is his ticket to get a fucking free meal and free fucking beer. That's all he cares about. Mooney the fucking moocher. He will eat whatever you got. He will drink whatever you got and care less and say, go fuck yourself and leave. So as he's fucking leaving, he had three cans of fucking whatever, and he th throws them in the garbage cans, and I asked him if he's going to clean my, close my garbage can. He said, no, go fuck myself. Walk, walked off with a big fucking attitude because huh, I just deleted him out of my fucking plans of going shopping. See, he's fucking smart because last time I took him shopping, I first thing I said to him, do you got any money? He goes, fuck, no, I got no money. But I got nothing else to do. So what does that tell you? Oh, so uh, you're going to go shopping with me and then what, go home? Or you're just going to hang around and uh, let's have a fucking cookout? 
eat what I got and then fucking leave and tell me to go fuck myself and that uh, it's not his problem that I don't have no food and I don't have no money. It's not his fucking problem. This motherfucker's got a job. He's working every day making fucking money but he wants to fucking mooch off of what I got planned. He asked me if he could drink the beer I got. You know, I, I got maybe seven or eight beers. He wants to drink them. And that pissed him off that I told him no. That pissed him off. So he's pretty much here for a handout. He, he takes his goddamn fucking paycheck, goes to the fucking bar, blows it all in the fucking bar. And then he comes over here to see what he can get what he can get. It's all about what he can get and when he's going to get it. He sees me as a fucking money bags and someone to uh, get a free ride off of. Pop the big fucking attitude again and left. Just like last time he went with me to the store. He got pissed off because he didn't get a blood orange. He got pissed off because he got a hard Mike lemonade. He got one of these. Hard Mike lemonade. He wanted a fucking blood orange. You only get three in a fucking 12 pack. He wanted a blood orange. He's like a spoiled little fucking brat. He didn't want the fucking... I told him, I should have told him right there and then, go fuck yourself and leave. You don't want a regular hard mic lemonade? Go fuck yourself. But friends like Mike, who needs enemies, right? Now he's all pissed off at me because he found out I got fucking money and I'm going to go to the goddamn store and fucking live it up. He's fucking pissed. He thinks I owe him a fucking blowjob and a fucking let me fuck him, let, let him fuck me in the ass and eat my food, drink my fucking beer and then fucking leave. Tell me to go fuck her off. He's pissed off now. You know what? I can care less. He has no morals, no sense of value. He doesn't care about nobody or nothing. He don't even care about himself. Fucker's walking around like a ticking time bomb with high blood pressure and all he's thinking about is getting drunk. You can give him a whole fucking case of beer and he would drink it all. I don't need friends like that. And he wants to move in. Sure. Yeah, he'll love to move in. Because then he's right at the source of the fucking kingdom. This is my kingdom. He wants to get into my kingdom and fucking live it up. I, I can't deal with this shit anymore. You know? I'm on a fucking deathbed. And all he cares about is getting a free meal and free beer. Yeah, sure. I know it. He sees them fucking steaks. Duh. I don't want a half of one. I want a whole one. Because when I told him, oh, yeah, well, he watched the video. He right here sat here, right here, watched me and said, I'm going to get the bow tie pasta salad. I'm going to get the potato salad. And I'm going to get the fruit fluff. I ain't fucking stupid, Mike. If you're watching this, I know what you're thinking. When you go shopping with me, you're going to want to eat. You're not just going to leave. You're like a little child. You need to grow the fuck up. Quit blowing your goddamn money. See? Does it look like I got a problem, Mike? I don't blow my fucking money in a goddamn bar. I ain't stupid like you. You need to fucking grow the fuck up. You want to fucking live life normal? Then quit going to the bar and quit spending money. Don't, don't tell me what to do with my money. But then don't tell me what to do with my money, motherfucker. This video's over.
done.